guys so today is the first proper day i suppose in my week off and i'm going to try and vlog every day um so yeah i'm gonna try and vlog every day for my week off well technically my week off started yesterday but today's monday so i thought i'd start it on monday um i have no expectations for what these vlogs are gonna be like because i haven't really got anything planned um today i'm going to the cinema later so obviously that's not something i can vlog while i'm there um but update i've got a new camera um as you may or may not know i normally vlog on this which is what i film my main channel videos on this is a uh canon 600d but um it's not really practical for vlogging because it's just massive like yeah it makes my arm hurt if i'm quite honest so i've gone and got myself a little little point and shoot kind of camera and the quality is not as good obviously but it's going to make it easier for me to try and start vlogging out and about because it's just more practical so this is what i've gone and got myself it's a panasonic panas panasonic uh lumix something i'll link it down in the description if you're interested it's got the flippy up screen um and yeah it was really cheap as well i got it on amazon i got it on amazon it had about 100 quid knocked off it on amazon and i also had a voucher from my birthday for 35 pounds so i only paid like 70 odd pounds for it which is pretty good and like i said the quality is not great but if it means that i'll have more confidence to go out and about vlogging with it then that would just make my life easier and it's also got wi-fi which i liked the idea of having because i could take pictures on it and have it slightly better quality to my phone and then insta i can instagram it so i thought that was quite cool as well um i have a real problem when filming videos at looking at the thing up there i think it's more problematic on this camera because the screen is up here whereas on a dslr it's there so I'll try and not look at myself, but, um, what can I say? I'm just so vain. Um, yeah, as you saw earlier, the weather is really, really miserable today. Um, so I should be going to the cinema, but as it feels really autumnal, I want to tr try and dress kind of autumnally. I'm going to wear boots, which I haven't, I haven't worn boots in months. I've been living in my trainers and my sandals for the past few months, um, Normally, every autumn winter, I always wear boots, but, um, not, no, not autumn winter. Normally, every summer, I still wear my boots, I meant to say. But not this summer. I've been committing to sandals and trainers. So, I'm going to try and throw a little nice autumny outfit together. Even though it's still, like, 16, 17 degrees, it's a little bit warm still to be dressing full-on autumn, but I'll see what I can do. And, as I've got time because I'm not really doing anything else today. Is this focused? I can't tell. Can't tell if it's focused. Uh, yeah, because I'm not really doing anything else today. Um, I was going to say, I want to try and do a full-on makeup look with like a dark lip and stuff like that because I've just been wearing nude lipsticks for a while. I put, bought some makeup earlier online. I don't know what it's going to get here, but it was from a website called Save On Makeup. And it's basically got loads of high-end makeup on there for cheap because they're like ex-testers that haven't actually been used and stuff like that. So I got some pretty good bargains. I got a Chanel foundation for £12. Um, I've just kind of winged it on the shade, so it could be the complete wrong shade for me. What else did I get? I think I got Estee Lauder lip gloss and some other bits and bobs. So yeah, I'm going to kind of mooch around for a little bit, then I'll have a bath and get dressed and stuff like that, see where the wind takes me. The wind? Does that make sense? I don't know. Um, where's my phone? don't know where my phone is. Um, there it is. So, it's 11 o'clock. Yes, I'm still in my pyjamas looking gross and it's 11 o'clock. Don't judge me. Um, my sister finishes work at 1. I might try and convince her to go out before we go to the cinema somewhere. 
but the weather is pretty horrendous. Um, I think we're going to go to the 20 past 5 cinema showing. If not, there's one at 8. Um, so, yeah. I don't know why I always vlog from this angle because it's really unflattering. Right, I will talk to you guys a little bit later. My hair is crazy. So much hair going on. Need to do something with it. Okay, talk to you guys later. Okay, so I've done most of my makeup. I just need to choose what lip to do. Don't know why that took me so long to say that. Um, so I've got some choices. I'm going to show you what I'm kind of thinking of doing. Um, it looks... I can't make this decisions when my hair isn't how I'm going to wear it. I mean, I haven't done my hair yet, but I will be wearing it down. Hold on. And I've just dropped something, so hold on. Okay, so I'll talk you through my whole makeup look when I'm done. I've put all the products to one side for what I used on myself. Um, so I'm going to show you the possible lip products. It may end up that I hate all of them anyway and just end up doing a nude lip as per usual. Oh, my chair will never stay put, it always rolls over. So yeah, I'll show you guys. Oh no, I didn't want that one. My jeans are disgusting, they're covered in hair and stuff. Okay, so I've got two liners. Um, I've got the, they're both from MUA got berry wine and what's the red one called brooding plum so they might be able to go with like this one's a good match for this one so we'll see depends on what i use i've got the MUA lip switch duo so this end is a lipstick and this end is a gloss that goes with it i don't know whether to go with a more purple or a more red tone though that's where i'm stuck i've got the styler lip glaze stick in the colour I think it was yeah blackberry um that is not a lip product that is brow drama <laughs> and then for lipstick I could go with sex kitten from Too Faced which looks like this this camera isn't actually that good I have to say well it's just a big change from my DSLR I'll get used to the less quality. Um, this is a mattifying lip rouge from Muranesi. I don't know if that's the brand or not, but um, this is a really cool like formula texture thing. I can't remember what colour it is. It's kind of a berry, yeah. So it looks like this. And then, so it goes on kind of velvety kind of glossy and then it goes matte with, and it's really pigmented I think I'm going to give that a go with some lip line okay so I've done my makeup um it, I think it looks nicer like in the mirror than it does on the camera I'm not really feeling it in the camera but um that's okay um it doesn't really matter does it I lined my lips with berry wine lip liner from MUA I used this mattifying lip rouge that I told you guys about. It's in the shade number 6, which is Paris. It looks much pinker here than it does in real life. It's definitely much darker in the mirror. Um, what else did I use? So I'll just show you the makeup look. There is no concealer in the world that will conceal these bad boys, just saying. Okay, so I used Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum Foundation. Um, for contour, I used this number seven foundation, which is really, really dark. So I used that for contouring my um, like cheekbones and stuff. And then on, on top of that, I used the Good To Glow Matte Bronzer from Poundland. Um, highlighters, I used the cream one, which was the Rimmel good to glow again that's weird um in the color notting hill glow and then on top of that i used the mua iridescent gold highlighter um concealer i used the ysl touche eclat um powder i used this ysl hi <laughs> ysl translucent powder loose powder thing 
um, eyes. I used two colours from the Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette. I used two colours I've never used before. I used the top right one, which is Semi Sweet, and the bottom left, which is Hazelnut. I normally opt to use, my go-to ones are Marzipan Creme Brulee and, where is it, Milk Chocolate. There. Love that palette. Um, eyeliner, I use this Barry M. Cole eyeliner to line my waterlines. Super Cat liner on top. Um, brows, I used Archery from Soap and Glory. And then lashes, I used Roller Lash and the Hypnose Lash from Lumcom. Is it called, what's it called? Hypnose something? I'm not sure, but I love these two combined. I love them a lot. So that is all my makeup that I used. I'm really dreading going out now because I'm just looking at the rain. I hate going out in rain. Um, so I'm just wondering if there's any point in me straightening my hair. Um, because although my hair does tend to... If I curl my hair, it goes straight in the rain. But... Um, oh, I'm keep dropping it. But I'm just wondering if I should just put my hair up. Because then I wouldn't have to wear... A hood I could just take an umbrella um, so I don't know um, yeah so we're going to walk around the shops and stuff like that there's not that many and um, then we'll go to the cinema and then I think we're gonna go to Pizza Hut afterwards and I'm contemplating getting changed but I don't really know I've, I've still got hours to go yet though it's Oh, not that long really, 20 past 2, film's at 20 past 5, so that's 3 hours, so I'll probably be leaving in a few hours. Um, so yeah, I'm going to keep straightening my hair, and then kind of decide what I'm going to wear, and then I'll probably be on my merry little way. Okay, so I did decide to change my top, I wasn't feeling the tight crop top, I wanted something a little more loose. Um, something I wanted to show you guys was... This little guy, he's really, really little. So, this is my new cactus. <laughs> Wanted to show you guys this. So, this is my new little cactus friend thing. Um, he's very small, as you can see. That's him in my hand. Um, my sister bought him for me when she went to Margate recently. Um, I've decided to call him Ollie. Um, if you watch Joe Stug's vlog, then you'll know why I've called him Ollie. So yeah, I have a cactus now. Um, I'm not sure how much I'm supposed to water it, because one, it's very tiny, and two, I know you're not supposed to water them that much, or that often, or something like that. So, I'm not sure about that one. Um, so I'll have to look that up, or feel free to tell me how often I'm supposed to water it um, that would be much appreciated so what's the time it's 10 to 3 my sister is really taking her time up Tesco I have to say she finished work at 1 it's 10 to 3 that's really bad um, so I'm just going to kind of hang around lay low until I have something else to update you guys with I've put my hair in a side part in a middle parting and um yeah not really too sure about it got some roots going on but um i don't know i think it looks okay oh really don't know why i bothered straightening it oh, it's so long i really want to cut it i think i will but i've just got to i don't know I'm really, really hungry. I'm going to buy lots of snacks for the cinema, I have decided. Hello. Um, it's very windy, so if you can't hear the next bit, then that is why. Um, I'm just going to show you my outfit of the day.
time. Okay guys, so um, I'm home now um, and I'm just going to wrap this up really quickly because I'm editing the video now. So I will wrap this up and I'll talk to you tomorrow about things that happened today, I suppose. Um, so yeah, night guys, I'll talk to you tomorrow.